Two U.S. Navy jets dropped four unarmed bombs into the Great Barrier Reef after a training exercise went wrong. The jets were running low on fuel, forcing the pilots to make the emergency drop. The Navy is working with Australian authorities to determine if the bombs can be retrieved. The two fighter jets were supposed to drop the bombs on a range at Townshend Island, just off Australia's east coast near the reef, but were told the range was not clear of hazards. After several failed passes, the aircrafts executed an emergency jettison because they couldn't land with the payload. The Navy says the pilots chose to drop the bombs in an area away from the actual reefs, which was also deep enough to prevent passing ships from running into them. None of the four bombs exploded, but environmentalists in Australia are infuriated, calling the move outrageous. Australian Senator Larissa Waters asks, have we gone completely mad? Is this how we look after our World Heritage Area now, letting a foreign power drop bombs on it? According to the United Nations World Heritage Organization, the reef is the world's largest coral structure and is home to thousands of marine species. It is also the only natural habitat for several species facing the threat of extinction. U.S. Navy officials say they are already in the early planning stages for a salvage operation to recover the bombs. For Newsy, I'm Logan Tittle.